Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to curve your text into a circle. And the first step for you to do that is to click on text. And I'm going to go with this font called Winter Nights for the outside part of the design. And today we're going to do a fall theme design. So um, I'm going to go with let's see, pumpkins. Uh, hay rides. Just thinking of fall related items, leaves, bonfires, and s'mores. Who doesn't like s'mores, right? Uh, and then to curve, you're going to click up here where it says curve. And you're going to curve inward like this. Uh, now make sure not to go to 100 because you see how the words will touch at the bottom and that just doesn't look aesthetically appealing. I found that if you put 99, it usually works best. Oop, didn't not see 99 right here. See, that looks pretty even. So that's going to be the outside part of the design. Uh, for the center part, I'm going to add another element. And so the same thing, we're going to click on text. Uh, except that I'm going to use a different font for this one. I'm going to go with um, Farmhouse Script. And so since it's fall, we're going to go hello fall. Now, you see there's a big gap between the two words, hello and fall. So we're going to fix that. And to do that, you go up here where it says line space. And if you want to bring them together, it will be a negative, no negative number. Um, let me try C 4.5 maybe. Okay, that looks good. Uh, and now, as you can see, hello kind of looks too small to fill the space in the middle of the design. So we're going to make it a little bit bigger. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. I like the way it looks. And I will add right to the center. And that's it. That's, uh, that's how you curve your text into a circle. And we added this little design in the middle just to make it look nicer. Uh, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the like button. And make sure to catch your next video. Bye-bye.